Hey everyone, so you can now pre-order the brand new Amazon Fire Max 11, the biggest and should be most powerful tablet Amazon has ever made. Uh, so here in the US, it will come out on June 14th. I have pre-ordered mine. Mine's supposed to come out or get to me on that day. So hold, here is crossing my fingers, hoping it will. Uh, but this is what we know so far of it. So again, it is 11 inch display. It is a full HD display, so nothing too fancy there. Just like all of their other tablets, there's usually nothing too fancy with their displays. Uh, then full HD means it'll be just like the HD 10, HD 10 Plus, uh, whereas the 8 and the 7s do not have full HD. You will have 4 gigabytes of RAM, up to 14 hour battery life, and then it will come in gray. It looks like that's the only color, which is kind of disappointing in my opinion. Uh, I do like all the other funky colors, like the blue uh that they come in but this time it's just gonna be gray kind of like the hd8 hd10 plus versions where only came in one color uh so again here in the us it is gonna be 230 dollars for a 64 gigabyte version with live screen ads and if you do not want those ads pay an extra 15 dollars and they will not have ads now what's interesting this year though is if you go with the 128 gigabyte version there are no ads. There is no choice to even have the ads. So it's $280, get double the storage, and you have no lock screen ads. So that is pretty cool. Uh, so in past years, you always had option with or without lock screen ads. Uh, if you want to pay a bit more, you do not get the ads, just like with the 64 gigabyte version of this tablet. There are going to be a few different bundles. You can get the 11 by itself, or you can get it with a keyboard. If you want to do that, which again, of course, the price goes pretty far up there. Uh, you can get it with keyboard and stylus if you want. Then you're paying even more. You can get it with a slim cover. Or you can get like how I'm getting mine with just the stylus. Uh, the stylus by itself is $35. Uh, and again, this will come with 4 gigabytes of RAM. Going off of actually Best Buy's website underneath their specs for this new tablet, the processor that's going to be in here is going to be a MediaTek processor once again. That's how they pretty much have always been, at least for as long as I can remember. It will be a MediaTek 8188J, uh, and according to Amazon, it's supposed to be about 50% faster than the Amazon Fire HD 10, HD 10 Plus. Otherwise, what was their best tablet before this one? Then here is a little bit of a video from Amazon on the stylus and the keyboard. Uh, both of them do look rather nice. Again, I am personally getting the stylus, but I'm not getting the keyboard. I just don't have a use for the keyboard myself. Then going off of Amazon's press, uh, press center. So again, 11 inch display. It is just going to be full HD though. Nothing too, too fancy there. Uh, I will be a new slim lightweight aluminum design though. So that should be pretty cool instead of just the plastic like in the past. It will be a 2.2 gigahertz processor. Again, it will be a MediaTek processor. 4 gigabytes of RAM, which is a little bit disappointing. Uh, personally, I think they should have at least 5 or 6. You know, 6. Uh, but 4 gigabytes of RAM, we'll see how that does. Again, the HD 10, it does okay. Or HD 10 Plus does okay. But we'll see how it does here. Up to 14 hours of battery life. Of course, that depends on how you use your device. It will now have Wi-Fi 6. As long as you have everything else necessary for Wi-Fi 6, you can get Wi-Fi 6 connectivity, which is awesome. Again, 64 or 120 gigabyte versions. Whatever you want. Either way, you're getting that 4 gigabytes of RAM. Uh, again, you can get it with the keyboard or the stylus or both or the cover. Uh, and of course, the keyboard is also a keyboard cover. Another new feature that sounds pretty cool is the power button is going to be having a fingerprint, uh, I guess I'll okay, say sensor in it. Uh, so have a fingerprint sensor to unlock your device if you want to do that. So that is brand new for this as well. Uh, it will also now have enhanced cameras. They are both rear and front are going to be 8 megapixel up to 1080p HD video recording, so it should be better enhanced cameras. Uh, so of course, being on a tablet, they're usually not the best. Uh, we'll see how they are. I'm sure they still won't be too, too good, but they're supposed to be better than what they were. 
Then, of course, being an Amazon device, you can use Amazon A with it uh, to control all your smart home features. And then anything else you can do with Amazon A. Uh, I'm not going to say her name. So, personally, I am very excited for this to come out. Again, June 14th is when it comes out. Uh, this is about all we know so far. Uh, again, you can see a little bit of the way it looks here. And it does look pretty dang nice. Going all the way back up to the top here. Uh, it looks like a very nice device. Again, 11 inches. So it will be the biggest device so far. Uh, I'm super excited. You guys let me know which one you are pre-ordering. If you're pre-ordering one, uh, what size, you know, 64 or 120 gigabytes with or without ads, and maybe what bundle you're going to get. Again, I am getting the stylus bundle. I already pre-ordered mine this morning. Thank you all very much for watching. As always, I appreciate it. Hope you have a good one. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.